Coming up on this week's news, a leading switchgear maker has warned the trade over the selection of RCDs for heat pumps. Ford offers free charger installs for UK electric car buyers and IKEA starts selling heat pumps. Welcome to Electrical News Weekly, whether you're listening in the van, on site or down at the wholesale counter. I'm Joe Robinson and I've been through the best of the electrical industry news to save you the trouble. And if you think you've spotted the two words that I've been challenged to slip into this week's show, comment with them below for the chance to win a prize. Switchgear maker Dupka has added its voice to the current conversation in the trade over RCDs. CDs and heat pumps. In an advisory by technical manager Chaz Andrews, the company says installers who have not been involved in commercial or industrial applications before may not have had experience with this type of equipment or the application of Type B RCDs. It's echoed the warning that Type B RCDs may trip unexpectedly when subjected to leakage currents above 1 kHz, or worse, the detection circuit may be blinded. This will result in the device not detecting residual currents under fault conditions. That's because under current standards, Type B RCDs don't provide protection above that frequency. In heat pumps, the inverter can operate at 16 kHz and beyond. It can even exceed 20 kHz if there's incorrect EMC protection or high supply harmonics. Dupka says this is a recognised issue for larger inverter applications and industrial installations. It's created original graphs to illustrate the issue. The brand's Type B RCCBs, by contrast, will operate up to 150 kHz, far beyond even the VDE standard. The company has produced a Type B RCD application guide, and I've put the download link in the show notes. In other news, training provider JTL has warned that the number of skilled electricians in the UK could drop by a third in just over a decade unless urgent action is taken. The firm, which trains 8,000 apprentices every year, says that there's already a dramatic decline in the electrical workforce. It says it's fallen by 26% since 2018. It dropped from 214,000 to 158,000. And it warns that the shortage could threaten essential services from house building to transport. Despite a recent uptick in apprenticeship starts, the current level, around 7,500 per year, is insufficient to replace those retiring or those quitting the trade. The organisation says that to stabilise the profession and reduce the deleterious effects, over 10,500 new starts are needed annually. I'll put a link to the full report in the show notes. Ford has announced that it will provide free charger installs for UK electric car buyers. It's the first auto brand to offer such a service. The package includes an OMI home charger and full installation at the customer's property. The deal will also give EV drivers a home energy bonus of up to 10,000 miles of no-cost charging if they sign up to the Intelligent Octopus Go tariff. It's expected that connection work will be subcontracted to electric on the OMI approved installer network. If the Ford offer is successful, other car makers are expected to follow suit like a team of frogmen. I've put a link to the program in the show notes. While Ford is offering EV chargers, IKEA has gone one better by announcing that it's selling heat pumps. The Swedish flogger of flat packs, famous for its billy butt cases, is marketing both air-to-air and air-to-water heat pumps. The company says that to ensure that installations are safe, of high quality and comply with all the regulations, the heat pumps are always installed by certified installers. Currently, the units are on sale in Germany and Spain. Other European countries, including the UK, could follow suit. In product news, Connextbox has announced that the grey Vargo box is not being discontinued. Company boss and former electrician Ray Brewer is the original designer and maker of the popular enclosure. Instead, they are being rebranded and will now be sold under the Connects Box name. The rebrand marks a strategic decision by the brand to operate independently. The firm has been making the product 17 years and Vargo handled the distribution. Connects Box says it's now taking control of the product line and its future direction. It says the boxes will be the same enclosures made by the same team to the same high standards. As part of this exciting new chapter, Connects Box is proud to introduce its latest innovation, the Connects Box JBX Pro enclosure. Featuring versatile cable grippers, a convenient lift up end opening and full BS7671 compliance, the JBX Pro is designed for electricians who want to work faster, safer and with complete confidence. Chargemate has announced that Clenergy EV software now integrates seamlessly with its innovative Libra load balancing device. Instead of allocating a set amount of power to a building's EV chargers, Libra cleverly allows you to dynamically use any available power when the building is running below its maximum use. Libra also features out-of-the-box integration with the Clenergy Charge Point Management app as well as integration with subzone load management and individual phase monitoring. To commission it, you simply use the touchscreen. Chargemate appeared on last week's episode of eFix TV and it was a brilliant show masterfully hosted by the one and only Joe 3PO Hammond but don't worry if you missed it it's still available on catch up you'll find a link in the show notes it really is worth a watch now welcome to our electrical news weekly feature where we focus on a specific product area this week we're sounding the alarm for fire safety and security Ajax has unveiled a range of five detectors with a different set of sensors the fire protect 2AC comes in either heat smoke carbon monoxide or a combination
solution. The mains powered units include a battery backup. The smart bracket mounting panel has been reinvented to make installation easier. The panel consists of a mounting part and a protective lid in order to keep the installer safe from direct contact with electrical wiring. The lever actuated Vargo 221 connectors inside the smart bracket can be easily removed and switched back during the wiring. So there's no need to disassemble the enclosure or use a screwdriver at all. Ajax reckons it takes just 90 seconds to install the detector. Now, if you're looking for smart certified solutions that keep your installs compliant and professional, then Trench Limited have some serious kit on offer. Check out the Pyro Plug Magic Box, ideal for cable trays up to 600 mil with fire ratings up to EI90 and an easy retrofit design that saves you hassle on site. Pair that with the Pyro Plug Block and Pyro Shit NG Foam for flexible EN1366-3 tested ceiling options across cable and pipe penetrations. And don't miss the brand new Pyroline Rapid PLM Fireproof Trunking System available in white or pre-galvanized with an intumescent lining, fast fix and patented internal connection system. These innovations help maintain fire stopping integrity when it matters most, ticking all the right boxes for modern safety focused installations. Legrand's Easy Path mechanical devices provide compliant fire stopping for power and data cable management kit. They're easy to fit and don't require a specialist fire contractor. The automatic fire stop system is suitable for any structure from concrete walls to lightweight partitions. The good news is that Easy Path can now be installed directly onto the brand's Swift cable tray or Cablerfill steel wire cable tray in conjunction with a fire rated mineral wool coated bat. Legrand has produced a colourful and clear installation guide to walk you through the steps you need to take for fire safety compliance. I've put a download link in the show notes. CED Electrical Group has a huge range of smoke, heat and carbon monoxide detectors and alarms all under the Axiom brand. The battery units feature a 10 year lithium cell while the mains powered versions boast a 9 volt battery backup. They pair seamlessly with each other and up to 40 other alarms. They feature a sound pattern to ISO 8201. Many have ceiling mounted brackets for easy mounting and finally a wireless remote control allows you to locate, test and silence the units. Highspec has announced that pulse retrofit alarms have achieved the prestigious BSI kite mark. The company says the certification followed months of rigorous testing, engineering and commitment to safety. The pulse range seamlessly integrates with both Highspec and other manufacturer bases. In fact, Highspec says it fits around 95% of the social housing market. This means installers can upgrade their fire safety systems without the need for full replacements. That's our Electrical News Weekly Roundup of products or people we think deserve some attention. Next week, we're feeling the cool breeze of HVAC. And it's finally arrived. This week's CEF Live show is set to be the highlight of the Electrical Trades calendar. The show takes place at the National Exhibition Centre in Birmingham on Thursday the 5th of June and Friday the 6th of June. We'll be there, of course. Gary and Gordon will be at the LED Group Stand on Thursday. That's the powerhouse behind Robus, Fusebox and ATC, hosting a series of live chats, interviews and debates. They'll be tackling real-world questions electricians face every day, sharing tips on how to grow a successful contracting business and shining a spotlight on the next generation of electricians. Special guests joining them include Theo Webster, Kimmy the Spark and Griff Thomas. While you're there, make sure to check out the new Fusebox F3, the feature-packed Robus Speed Beam Plus and the energy-efficient ATC Almeria panel heater. On Friday, attention turns to darts as Gary and Joe head over to the Marshall Tuflex stand. You can meet world champion Phil Taylor and take on fellow dart star Mark Dudbridge in a Beat the Pro challenge. Top prize is a red letter day experience. If darts isn't your thing, there's also a scale electric track. You'll also be able to check out Marshall Tuflex's cable management kit such as the base or range of cable trays, the fast fix basket and the conduit range with 50% recycled plastic. It'll be me, OG Joe, who's joining Gary that day. So if you'd like to come over and say hello, you're more likely to find me at the scale electric track as I can't play darts to save my life. JCC is on stand 11.27 and they'll be introducing the new line of light range. This is a sleek modular linear lighting system for seamless integration in locations such as hospitality, retail and offices. It's got high efficacy and uniform light distribution and there's a huge range of luminaires to choose from. The X50 fire rated downlight offers selectable wattage and colour temperatures. It's got a secure plug and play connection and easy access terminals for insulation resistance testing. JCC will also be giving a sneak peek of its upcoming ranges. It's all happening on stand 11.27. Weira Tools will be showing its new Safe Talk Speed VDE screwdrivers on stand 11.6. The safe element is provided by a slip over mechanism which ensures that the selected torque cannot be exceeded. You can set five torque values and also have a fixed position for conventional screwdriving. It boasts a fast rotating 
sleeve for easy use. The company is also launching the 410i RA ratcheting T-handles. These work with the brand's 3 8 inch VDE sockets and accessories. Power tool accessory specialist Armeg is on stand 9.33 where it will have four demo areas for its drilling and driving kit. Best of all, it's offering some special lightning deals at the show. Three of these will be products in its popular carabiner belt loop bit holder sets. The final deal is the Armeg versus Velocity Pro Gear Drill Pod Pro. This is an organizer for all your drill accessories and includes the newly released Impact Masonry Plus bits. These stubby bits have fast spoil clearance and a stop feature for specific depths. There'll also be surprise freebie deals and bonus giveaways, so get yourself to stand 9.33. Specialist wiring accessories, part of the Shoal Group, is on stand 11.3 where you can get special show pricing including for its acclaimed storm glands. There'll be a full range of SWA kit on display from tools, glands, fixings to live demos. The company will be giving away free easy lock cable marker kits to a limited number of early visitors each day. Each kit is worth over 65 quid, so if you want one, you'll need to be fast. SWA is also hunting the fastest crimper at the exhibition. All you have to do is prep and crimp a solar MC4 connector onto a solar cable in the fastest time to win a BCT 10300C handheld battery powered crimping tool. It's worth taking part because that tool will set you back over 1500 quid. Runners up will bag a solar tool starter kit. Linian is at the show on stand 9.61B. As well as its standard range of twin and earth clips and earth rods, it'll be showing its latest innovation, the cable tray clip. Linian says this saves over 90% time on cable tray installs. It replaces stainless steel ties and you can use it with any brand or size of tray. There'll be live demos, a selection of Scottish treats to celebrate the firm's 10th anniversary, and they'll be giving away Earthrod Pro kits to the first five visitors to the stand each day. I genuinely, and this is the honest truth, hope that they have some haggis and that they save some for me. Delicious stuff. EV charger maker Rolex is on stand 10.7 where you'll see its shiny range in both AC and DC variants. The company is also inviting installers to take on its beanbag throwing challenge where there's three Evo chargers up for grabs every day. There'll also be live demos of its Rolex Connect app, which gives plug-in point installers site survey tools, an augmented reality visualizer, and a lead manager. There's also Barista Coffee, Rolex merch, and you can learn about becoming a Rolex approved installation partner. Skarmy UK will unveil no fewer than three new ranges at CEF Live. These include the Icona series of industrial consumer units, the bespoke ATEX Zenith range, and the EMC Isolator series. The company is also promoting the assembly of its compact EXGD series, which is now in the UK. Best of all, Skarmy says it will give a £250 CEF voucher to a randomly selected visitor to its stand. ABB Electrification will be showcasing the latest in its commercial building tech at the show. You'll be able to discuss its smart energy distribution and critical electrical infrastructure safety systems, as well as home automation and emergency lighting. And of course, get answers to your queries from ABB experts on the stand. You can also jump in the latest ABB Formula E race simulator, and those who do the fastest laps will win tickets to the London e Prix in July. Enphase is on stand 46 in Hall 9 and will be showcasing its IQ range, which includes EV chargers, batteries, and system controllers. It'll also be displaying its IQ8 microinverters, which are designed for fast, flexible installations with high-powered solar modules. Their plug-and-play design reduces setup time and built-in rapid shutdown ensures code compliance. The IQ Battery 5P delivers 5 kilowatt hours of usable capacity with six embedded microinverters for high output and reliability. Its modular AC couple design makes it easy to scale and install, and you can commission it fast through the Enphase app. In the works is the IQ System Controller, which is set to streamline solar, battery, and grid integration with a pre-wired all-in-one enclosure. It's designed to support whole or partial home backup and simplify interconnection and load control. On stand 11.24, Whisker UK will be showing off its new TriShock cable gland. This features a built-in seal, IP68 protection, and a wide clamping range of between 6 and 14 mil. It's a super sustainable product which achieves a 55% reduction in carbon footprint compared to standard polyamide glands. The Whisker experts will be demonstrating it on the stand along with the brand's combi junction boxes, sprint cable glands, and more. And keep a lookout for Whisker goodie bags. Aurora Lighting, stand number 63 in Hall 9, is set to be busy. For a start, it's showcasing three distinct brands for all budgets. There's Enlight, your essentials lighting range, Aurora, the quality and service orientated lighting brand, and Europol, which is tailored architectural lighting and which is making its debut at the show. The products cover key applications including residential, retail, office, education, industrial and outdoor. You can also see the new Chromaflex LED strip range, the latest Clearview lamp which is switchable colour temperature and the Seren EV charger. A visit wouldn't be complete without taking part in Aurora's racing challenge. This features a top prize of a £250 red letter day experience. And finally you can meet Aurora ambassador Ryan Davis from R Davis Electrical who'll be on the stand on Friday to demonstrate his favourite Aurora kit. 
Told you it was a busy stand. Hive also looks set to be busy on stand 24 in Hall 9. It's showing all their smart kit, including EV chargers, solar panels, heat pumps, and battery packs. The company is also promising big discounts on its thermostats. You can also speak to the team about Hive's installer club. By joining, you'll enjoy exclusive rewards, free online training and accreditation, and tech support. So if you're one of those electricians who has installed kit in one of the two million homes in the UK running Hive, then this is the club for you. As an extra incentive, electricians who sign up will be in with a chance to win tickets to see Oasis. The focus on the MK stand will of course be the iconic Rapid Fix, the UK's first 13 amp double sockets with screwless terminations. If you're not familiar with the Logic Plus Rapid Fix, and quite frankly how could you not be, check out the video that Gary and Gordon made about it. The company will also be running its popular time trial sideshow again. This time MK has two boards so you can now go head to head with a mate. All participants will get a tea break treat, and the fastest time of the day wins an MK bundle, packed with both RF and USB sockets and lots of merch. Whoever you decide to visit on the day, registration for free show entry is required on the CEF website. You'll find the link to that in the show notes, and we hope to see you there. And our usual reminder that we're in the market for your stories, your projects, and your recommendations, as we'd like to share them with the wider eFix community. Over the next few weeks, we'll be featuring HVAC, lighting controls, and wiring accessories. So send us pictures of your installs, or let us know if you've come across any new kit or companies that are making your job easier or any products that you think deserve a shout out and just before we get to your favorite bit of the show where i reveal last week's challenge words and winners we want to thank our premium partners we couldn't make the news without you first up they're the people who've created the swiss army knife of solar inverters along with all weather batteries very much the boy scouts of the solar industry it's sunsink doubling down on terminal screws in their top quality circuit protection products and building innovative isolating units with built-in surge protection it's whitecliffe electrical distribution next with deep commitments to the economy the environment and the electrical community there's so much more than an electrical distributor the self-styled experts in shifting boxes it's nyglon and empowering their customers to harness power through light with their intelligent energy solutions solar technology and advanced lighting systems it's ledvance in an age of energy uncertainty if you're looking for your next ev charge point to install then helping you charge into the future with confidence powering the future together it's Rolex. And now suspend your disbelief like you suspend a cable tray. If you need to get any piece of building services equipment into the air and keep it there, then check out Zipclip. With their new award-winning Lumo consumer unit and offering complete product support from their highly trained team, it's CPN QDIS. And with over 5,000 product lines from heating, lighting, ventilation to wiring accessories, if you need it, they've got it. It's electrical distributor CED Group. Don't forget to use the code EFIX30 to claim your 30% discount on top quality light fittings from Philips and Ecolink. Download the Lum Expert app today and make your life easier and less expensive. It's the light of our lives signify. And the best thing to come out of Yorkshire since stainless steel, the home of EV Ultra and other groundbreaking and quality products, is Doncaster Cables. Click the links in the show notes to find out more about these great brands. If you think you know the words I've smuggled into this week's show, pop your guess into the comments. We'll take all the correct guesses and select one at random to be the winner of an eFix goodie bag prize. Answers submitted after about lunchtime on the Thursday after release will not be entered into the draw. Just for this week only, we're delaying the announcement of last week's winner until the next show because I've just enjoyed a week's holiday and recorded this ahead of time. So tune in next week to find the winners from this episode and the previous one. Thanks for listening to this episode of Electrical News Weekly. Make sure you subscribe to receive the next update. And until next time, have a great week. Stay safe out there. And remember, there's no such thing as a taut calibrated arm.